One year ago, Derya Atsoy launched her passion project in Bodrum, a cafe slash library slash art gallery. And since art, literature, and nature are so important to her, she spent three days recreating a scaled-down version for the Istanbul Art Fair. We want to emphasize the connection between art and books. They are intertwined, and we are trying to connect them even more. We are trying to keep with our motto, read, listen, and watch as much as we can. During the course of the fair, she brought in authors to read their books, as well as musicians to perform. Across the hall, commercial interests are on the back burner, but the objective is no less grandiose. We discuss what approaches can be used in economic conditions that are getting worse for artists as well. Therefore, there's no place for hierarchy, political oppression or power struggle here. Instead of this, all artists can come together in an independent venue regardless of their age or experience. That's why we describe this exhibition as a collective based on relationships. The theme of this year's art show is experience. The concept, like the art itself, is something open to interpretation. Organizers say an experience in art and in life should have a liberating effect. It's a very wide concept, but in today's world, when experience can be bought and sold, when the authenticity of experience is debatable, and when we debate through philosophy and art whether a true experience is even possible, we discuss the proximity of art to experience, the possibilities art provides, and new ways of perception in art. Perception is key in this exhibit. Photography student Ismail Tarhan is showcasing work he and his classmates have produced. He says his friend's creation, reimagining the iconic Walt Disney movie intro, explains what media can and cannot offer viewers. The artists would have best explained both works, but this is my take on the piece. The Walt Disney opening sequence of a star circling a beautiful view that seems like it is offering something beautiful, but there is a razor blade in the middle of the image with a cleverly edited video that represents what we actually see nowadays in the media. Everyone's experience is different, of course. And that's precisely the point. This show hosts art galleries and independent artists alike. This space is important to us as it provides us with the opportunity to express ourselves. This is an international fair and it is very important to be here in this time when it is hard to be seen. The indie artists say they appreciate the opportunity to showcase their work in the same space as older, more established art galleries. Adil Halim, TRT World. Istanbul.